Dream Team. So today I'll be showing you how I installed the Blackhawk KN Air Filter onto my 2017 Toyota Tacoma. Pretty basic. This is the tools you'll be needing. Um, so step one, you turn off the ignition and disconnect the negative battery cable. Step two, you lift and remove the engine cover. Step three, re release the spring clamp and disconnect the crank case vent hose. Step four, you loosen the hose clamp, securing the factory intake tube. Step five, disconnect the mass air sensor, electrical connection, and unhook the harness from the air filter. I didn't follow the instructions. I completely removed the mass air sensor from the air intake. Uh, but if you follow the instructions, it'll make your life a little easier. Uh, I got it done within 45 minutes. You can still get it done within 30 minutes, I say. So step six, release the two clips securing the air filter housing and then remove the intake tube and air filter along with it. Uh, step seven, remove the three bolts securing the lower air filter housing to the inner fender and then remove the lower air filter housing from the vehicle. Now we have to know K&N does not recommend that customers discard factory air intake. Step 8, install the three provided rubber mounted studs onto the inner fender in the position shown. Step 9, install the provided heat shield bracket. Step 10, install the provided radius adapter onto the heat shield and secure with provided hardware. Step 11, install the provided edge trim onto the K&N heat shield. Step 12, install the heat shield onto the rubber mounted studs installed and secure with the provided hardware. Step 13, you install the provided hump coupler with the number 08171 onto the throttle body and secure with the provided hose clamp. 14, install the provided step coupler with the number 08496 onto the filter adapter and secure with the provided hose clamp. Step 15, remove the mass air sensor from the factory air filter housing. Step 16, install the mass air sensor into the K&N intake tube and secure with the provided hardware. Now, like I said, I didn't follow instructions, so I skipped to 18. You install the intake tube into the coupling hose at the throttle body and at the coupling at the filter adapter. Step 17, install the provided NPT vent venting into the K&N intake tube as shown. NPT fitting is only designed to be installed until hand tightened. Step 19, connect the crankcase vent fitting onto the vent fitting installed into the K&N intake. Last step, install the K&N air filter onto the filter adapter and secure with the provided hose clamp. All right, so now we're gonna do the test. How it sounds from the inside. Put your seatbelt on while you do the test like this. Alright. Do another one.